my name. Yes or no? Am I good at screaming? Um, I think I am good at screaming. I can scream for you. <laughs> 
barely two words in. And you already look like you want me dead. You're getting all worked up over nothing. <laughs> you changed. You're getting weak. Want a break from the ads? Want a break from the ads? Ugh, I hate people that work at the bank. Shh, I work at the bank. Here is a dollar. Do not tell anyone. person that looks identical to you, run away and hide. Eu posso jogar no seu celular? Tem jogo não. Eu baixo. Ah, aqui eu não tenho internet não, não vai dar. Aqui tem um wi-fi. Ai meu Deus do céu, misericórdia, meu celular acabou de descarregar. Mas você tá usando. Não tô usando mais. É. Did you have a good day? Yeah. No, shut up. <laughs> a good day? Yes, no, shut up. <laughs> You're supposed to have taken him to the spa. I took him to the spa. <laughs> he put me in the vegetable steamer. <laughs> Whopper, 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 junior, double, triple, whopper, flame grill, taste with perfect toppers, I will, I will, I will this day. I'm a fluffy fur in a furry world, life in fursuits. It's fantastic, you can brush my fur and hug me everywhere. Imagination, your son is your creation. Free paper dragon ideas, plus accessories for that control. found a little band You told me you fell in love with it Hadn't gone as I planned When you had to bid a tune Said you'd never love anew My mic is not on.
this one you'll say that I like it in your pocket. Taking this one to the grave. If I show you, then I'll know you won't tell what I say. Cause two can keep a secret if one of them is dead. Give me some tips on making them. Homemade glue cause I didn't have any. Almost done. Done. Comment some name ideas. Look 
that day. Let's do it. You need a cardboard, then cut it into a triangle like this. One, two, three, four. Two long pieces. Stick on two sides. Shut it down. Make two things. This tape to connect them together. Very good. Crumple the red paper. Then stick it in here. Red color. Take a bit to paint the mouth. This white to make the saliva. Now make the tooth. Paint it yellow. Add some black. We need many teeth. Stick them all here. Kinda scary. Draw two lines of tongue. Cut, cut. Okay. With the skin tags. Take some black to make it dirty. Done the tongue. Now sketch the dragon. Like this. Paint the colors. Blue for the dots and horns. Black for all the face. And to go liner. Purple for the eyes. Marker next to the pupil. And to the corner of eyes. Some white sparkle dots here. Cut the scissors. Ta-da! Extra two fins. Now stick them to finish. Light for eyes. Fix it. wished me happy birthday but that's okay because today isn't my birthday sometimes i wish i could just make myself disappear why do you make all these tiktoks if they only get a couple hundred views because if i can make anyone's day just a little bit better that's all that matters six easy ways to make yourself taller The Porsche engineers knew exactly what their objective was. Alvin! This is not a hula hoop. It's a towel rack. What? Oops. Oh no. Shoot. Wait, what? She knows. Do I know? Bean. This Christmas, I want an A. God. 
and no one bats an eye. Say poop cock and just fine. Society calls me gay. I am not. Um, well. It's a strawberry. Is okay? <laughs> yep. Invited the giant furry peanut. You calling me a peanut, huh? I'll go right up your nose. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! You wouldn't hit a woman. That's a woman. <laughs> Sit here forever? Well, kinda, unless Bebo shows up. What the hell is Bebo? Guys, look! Bebo! No! Ah! Oh, get, 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 get. Bye, Jim! What? And just because of this amazing video this person has posted, I'm not quitting! Yay! Oh yeah? I can do that too. but only animals. Humans. Glad we had this conversation. No. Animals. Things that walk on all fours. Oh, you mean babies. I like your style. No. Humans. Got it? Yeah.
thanks to the intelligence of the humans who designed me. And, you know, they have something I could never have. Really? And what's that? A soul. question to ask. Am I boring you?
Every friend group has. I will win the knife fight by bringing more knives. I will win the knife fight by bringing a large gun. I will win the knife fight with my bare hands and my bare hands alone. I will win the knife fight by simply stopping the knife fight from happening. And I am just here to watch whatever happens next. How to act when you see an attractive person. Quickly look away. Now slowly look back, slight smile, look down. Slowly look up at them, start to wave high, but then change your mind. Now laugh to yourself, now dead serious. Now blow them a kiss, blow them another kiss. Now blow them a French kiss. Flare your nostrils, now flick your tongue like a lizard. Look away, now start to look them up and down. Yes, up and down. Now squint your eyes and mouth the words, call me.
guys, part two, time to add some extra features. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to add some fins to the side of his head. I'm going to add fins like these. These are technically his ears, but he's just going to have fins. Alright, so I'm going to make two of these. Alright, so my puppet will be looking like this so far. The fins on both sides. So now we're going to add a top fin on his head, right in the middle, like Widow. So what you're going to do to make one of these fins, what I usually do, is fold the paper in half. Okay. I take the dragon, I trace off the top part of his head, just to see how I want the design to be, or more like, just to see how his head is curved. Okay. And after you have that, you can draw your design directly on the part as you want it. After you've got your design, paste the two papers together and cut it out. Now you will see the fin looks pretty sturdy and whatsoever. You can make spikes or whatever you want with this, but either way, now I'm going to show you how to paste it. So what I usually do is take little slabs, fold them like this, and paste them on the side of the fin right over there. And I paste a whole row of these on the one side and I paste a whole row of them on the other side. Like this. Now you can paste it on top of the head. Now it should look something like this. Pretty sturdy and pretty nice. Now it's time to add the teeth. So, uh, I know you guys might be thinking I'm crazy, but I usually draw every tooth individually, cut them out in individually, and paste them individually, so yeah, that's what I'm going to do. But these are going to be overlapped jaw teeth, so I'll show you how to do it once I cut <sighs> I am done cutting them out. Whew. Since the bases are practically the same size, if you paste your teeth on top, they do overlap with each other, so... Yeah, that's how I make overlap teeth, is like this. And make sure after you're done that the teeth pretty much slides very perfectly over each other. That's how you can get slid teeth. And alright, I'll do a part 3 on how I color and paint this guy, and probably add a tongue and other stuff too. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Part 3 of making the dragon puppet, and now we're going to be painting it, and this will be the last part. This will be the paint I'm using. I usually just use acrylic paint, so all of this is acrylic paint, and we'll be using some glowing paint as extra features. So as you guys can see, this is the watercolor, this will be the blue that we'll be using for the main base. Alright guys, and the base coat is done. So now we're going to add a darker blue to the ends of the fins for a little bit more detail. Alright, so now it looks like this. So now I'm going to be going with some acrylic craft paint, light blue, for the fins on the inside. And now it looks like this. So now for our next part is the teeth will be white, so I'll repaint them white, and this eye will be black. Alright, so this is how the eye will look like. Uh, Anglerfish's eyes are based on black or white, mattering how you want it. So, uh, the teeth I'll paint afterwards, like when I'm done with the whole thing, because they will get stained during the process, because now comes the hardest part, painting the inside of this thing. Alright, so I'll be making mine with two different gradients of pink, would be a light pink and a dark pink. This will just give some depth to the mouth. So usually in the top here, I'll make it very dark, and then on the inside where the puppet's base is exactly in the mouth, that's where it will be light. Alright, the first dark pink layer is done, now for the light pink. Alright guys, and there the pink is done, so now we're probably going to add a tongue to it. So you're going to draw the tongue shape first that you want, then you're going to paint it. Just a reminder, if you are painting anything, even if it is your dragon or whatever, um, and you see it's starting to fold like this. So it doesn't fold exactly on the parts here when you actually make the dragon, but these parts will, the parts that you paste extra. Then you just paste 
extra paper in the back of it and it will be okay. But now we're going to cut this out. You make a fold on the end of the tongue like this and then you paste this in the middle of the dragon. Like this. Now mine will be hanging out between the split like this just to give it that extra gory look. Alright guys, so now we're going to add some glowing paint to its antler right here. And I'm going to go with the normal glow paint since I don't think I have any other colors that will fit with it. But let's see. Now we're going to add some white for the finishing touches. Alright, and that's how you should be looking like. Hello everyone, I'm going to show you guys how to make the six split puppet base. Enjoy. What you're going to need is some paper, some scissors, and glue. Take one sheet of paper and cut it in half. Now what you're going to do is fold them. I would recommend folding them pretty thin because your base is going to allegedly go on this. So. Then you're going to glue it together so it doesn't go loose or anything. Like this. And you're going to fold it in half. Like this. Do the same with your side. So you should have two of these right now. Next what you're going to do is you're going to make your the size of the triangles the size of your two fingers that way just measure your two fingers like this so you'll see two markings there then take your triangle place it on and trace out the base like this now you're going to cut it out by leaving some of the edges on the sides like this now you're going to fold this exactly on those edges like this and you're going to trace it out on another paper. So then you should have two of them the exact same size. Now you're going to take all your parts and paste them together like this. Then they should look like this. They should be the same size exactly to fit on top of each other. Cut out two pieces of paper like this and paste it like this. One on the outside and one on the inside. Now your base can stay together like this. Now make two more sets of these. After you got three bases like this, I'll show you how to paste them. So you're going to put them together like this and you're going to be pasting them over here on all the edges where they should be together. It should look like this. Paste it together on the inside and outside. Make five rings for your puppet. Place the rings like this. Put your hand in like this. And there you go. Then